ขอบคุณค่ะThat was another glorious meal in Thailand. I just had some chicken and rice with sweet chili sauce there. And often you find in Bangkok, when you order a meal, you get a little side order of chicken broth. So you could almost say that was two courses and that cost 50 baht. Now, excuse me for the loud traffic, but we are in Bangkok. Now, I'm off to one of the biggest markets in the world. Chattachuk weekend market in Bangkok. It has over 15,000 stalls. So I'm off to the MRT train station now. I'm going to take a ride and check it out. I've got a little mission to find a fridge magnet for my mum back in England. And as there's 15,000 stalls, I reckon there's a small percentage chance that we might be able to find it. Welcome to Chattachuk um, Weekend Market, the biggest weekend market in the entire world. Now my first impressions are, it's actually a lot more open than I thought it was going to be. I was expecting it to be very tight, maybe mainly indoors, but there's actually sections of outdoors and indoor places here. that I'm not really a market person I'm more of an online shopper than a market guy but I do appreciate the atmosphere and the buzz you get in the market it's brilliant for people watching you see locals and tourists alike going up and down here and yeah basically you can buy whatever you want so I do understand why people like them I'm more of a fan of, to be honest, just walking around them rather than buying things. But um, no, it's good. I appreciate it. A lovely, a nice day as well. It's a Sunday. Weather's really good. I was a bit worried it might be a bit of a washout today because there were some quite serious thunderstorms last night. But luckily, it's, it's lovely weather here. Now that's a lot of trainers. If you want a pair of knockoff Nikes, this is this is the place to come. around this um, market which are very very useful if I turn my camera around the only issue with maps I'm such a bad map reader that I just end up walking around anyway so <laughs> they might be useful to some people but not me so it seems section 8 is the first section where we actually go indoors so let's check this out I always like indoor kind of markets I think they seem quite atmospheric
might have to buy a pair of elephant pants before I leave Thailand. Might have no choice. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Look what I found. I found my magnets. My mum will be happy. Can I have two two for forty? No, two for fifty. Two for fifty? Yes. Okay. I only need one. And I'm sure my mum will be delighted with her Christmas present this year. A one pound elephant fridge magnet. Overall impressions are it's good. It's obviously mainly just catered for tourism. But that's fine, and there's still plenty to eat and drink as well, which is nice. And if you want to buy any sort of souvenirs, any knockoff products, even sort of cannabis for sale over here, then you can get what you want. So, um, as you can hear as well in the background, it's pretty lively. I, I can imagine the later on it gets, the more livelier it will become. So, cheers, guys. Less work, more travel and uh, I'll see you on the next video, enjoy!